back or to me and my channel i know it's been a month or two since i posted but that's because i am in quarantine right now i really don't do anything productive i literally live every single day like it's the exact same day i genuinely think i i'm going insane <sighs> i've tried to film this intro just this intro like literally seven times already i don't know why like i already am not that good at intros anyways but i guess today because i haven't filmed in a long time it's taking even more time to do this and i don't know why and i don't know why i'm going on about this because then i'm probably going to refilm this as well but during quarantine i have been online shopping a lot and i actually bought this order with the intention of making a youtube video just because i was like i see a lot of princess polly videos not a lot from canadians mostly from people in the u.s but i decided might as well buy a couple things and do a video on it they didn't give me like a receipt thingy when my order came in so i'm just looking at what all this stuff is called on my phone and i don't remember how much money i spent i think i spent around 400 dollars on all this stuff which honestly is not bad because i got 10 things total yeah 10 i'm not going to keep rambling on and on because that is annoying so let's just jump right into the video okay i'm gonna start off with the accessories that i got this first item is these earrings it's not gonna oh it did focus great there's actually five but i'm wearing one of them it's like a heart pair they're called the mini hoop pack gold they're really nice really good quality i am a huge hoops person as you can see all my earrings are hooped in right now but i think these are really cute they're really good quality i like how dainty they are and they can just add to an outfit like i'm not a huge jewelry person but i'm trying to get into it so these were like a really good affordable way for me to buy more jewelry and everything is going to be linked down below as well i noticed i don't do that enough and what's the point of me showing you stuff if i'm not even gonna give you the link to buy it if you want to buy it ticks on my brain the next pair of earrings i got were just these gold crosses i don't know if it'll i don't think it'll focus because my big fat head is in the way i really like these too i really want cross jewelry i'm just really into it i want a cross necklace as well i just think it adds like spice i like how big they are so if i was wearing like these two hoops and then this i think it's super pretty i also need little studs for my fourth because i don't have anything small enough for that hole but anyways besides the point i really like these earrings those are called um these are called the bless up earrings i don't know why that took me so long to figure that out but i really like them the next thing i got was just this honey necklace I think it's so pretty like I I already said this like literally three sentences ago but I'm not like a huge jewelry person but I'm trying to get into it and I just think this necklace this is something my mom gave me but this necklace just laying it English this necklace and just layering it with this honey necklace it just adds a little more oomph to my outfit even though I'm wearing a white shirt and jeans and this is literally just called honey necklace in gold. I only like gold jewelry, by the way, because I have warm toned skin, so I'm not a fan of silver on myself. Okay, moving on to the tops. I'm gonna start with what I'm wearing right now. It is like just this sweatery kind of material white top. Um, I just really like this shirt. It's really comfortable. It's really soft. It's a warm kind. It's snowing outside. It's May 7th. And it's snowing outside i feel like you could wear this out on like a summer night just something casual this one's called the unwritten love top in white i really do like this it's so comfortable and i think dress it up or dress it down that's a lie i feel like you can only wear this casually but the way i wear it like maybe i'll get up and show you what i'm wearing these are just pants i thrifted but i'm wearing like this top with it and these pants i just feel like that's a cute little outfit i really do like it it's really good quality and this is in a size two i was gonna get a size zero because i like my stuff to fit a little bit tighter but i'm glad they didn't even have this in a zero because i don't know i feel like that would have been pushing it 
Also, I've been really into the color white lately. I just like the way it looks on my skin tone. So I got this, if I can hold it the right way. I got this cute little top. It's just a cute lacy. I really like it. This one's actually in a size zero. And when I was trying it on, I thought, yeah, this shit is not gonna fit me. But it fits really nicely. And I feel like if I would have gotten a two, it would have, it still would have fit me nice. But like I said, I like myself to fit a little bit tight. So this feels like it's literally not gonna fall off. Like I was, I showed it in the try on part. Like you can bend over and like move and stuff and it won't like slide down. And I really like the lace up detailing that it has. Yeah, it's just super cute. I, it's really good quality. This one's called the Carmen Top. It's so pretty. I was doing a dance in it. So this is TikTok dance friendly. I'm really glad I bought this. I was gonna take this out of my cart and then I was like, well, I'm using my credit card anyway, so, you know. Next top I got is a black top. Wow, versatility, black and white. This top is called the Pinch Me Top. I got this in a size zero. This is honestly, like when I was getting it on, it was really tight and I was like, fuck, I should have gotten it in a size two. But it's just a long sleeve top, it looks like this. It's kind of like a, not a V-neck, but an open neck. And then it's cinches, you can either have it, you'll see it better in the try and part. You can wear it like a bunch of different ways. You can either have it straight like this or cinch it up all the way, wear it off the shoulder, wear it on the shoulder. I really wish they had it in white when I was ordering, but it was all sold out. So I was like, okay, I'll just get the black one. But I really do like this. And the last top I got, I actually thought this was a bodysuit when I like took it out of the, when I bought it, I thought it was a bodysuit. Then I took it out of the package and I was like, Oh, is that like all it comes with? It's just this snake print tank top. The bottom part is like mesh and a bit see-through. Then it has like, it's not like really firm wiring, but it has, or am I describing that correctly? I don't know if I would call it wiring. It's just like a tighter elastic and it makes the shirt a little bit more structured. Why do I talk like that? Structured. I feel like this is more of a bar top, you know? Like I couldn't see myself just throwing this on to go to school, possibly. That was everything for the shirts. I really like all the shirts I got. They're really good quality and they fit really nicely. This is the only top I got in a size two. So keep that in mind when you're shopping. I guess it just depends on the kind of fit you want your clothes to be, but yeah. Um, moving on to the bottoms. So I got two bottoms in this haul. First, I got these blackish gray pants. They're like mom jeans, actually. I really do like these. The only problem is, and I expect this, they are really big on my waist. I feel like I definitely could have gone down to a zero. These are in a size two. I needed another pair of blackish mom jeans because the ones I have that I got from the thrift store I really like them but whenever I sit down I'm like these are in my cervix right now and that's just not what I'm going for when I'm trying to sit down in class like I want to not feel like my jeans are part of my womb you know I don't know I'm not mad I have these fit my waist but I feel like I could have gone down to a zero because there still is even a little bit of butt room in these but you get what you get next time I order jeans from there I'll know and I'm excited to have another pair of black jeans in my closet I got this super cute midi skirt I got this in a size zero perfect choice because it fits me amazingly I think it's so like sexy but in a classy way I'm pretty short no i'm not i'm like average height five four but these this midi skirt on the model it went i haven't been telling you what the f these are called those jeans are called the orissa knee rip jeans washed black and then the skirt is called the nia midi skirt this skirt goes down like past my knees and like mid shin on the model it kind of goes just to her knees I'm just gonna buy 
midi skirts from Princess Polly from now on. And lastly, hopefully I can get this in before my battery dies, um, is this beautiful dress. I knew it was gonna be pretty, but I tried it on and I was like, I'm just really excited to style this dress. I think it is super pretty. It's called the Maple May Mini Dress in Black, and it's not super short, which I like. If I really pull it down, it goes down a little bit over my knees, but because of my butt, it'll go up a little bit, which is okay. But it's a good length. It's appropriate. It's, it's a sexy, classy, just like the other skirt. Literally everything in this haul, I have been in love with. So Princess Polly, two thumbs up. That is everything for this haul. Thank you to everyone that made it this far and thank you to everyone for watching. You can follow me on my social medias if you want. They're always linked down below. Anyways, my battery is screaming at me to charge it. So thanks for watching this video and I will see you in my next one. Bye!